Hello everyone and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Revelations. I don't know quite why we're on the ground. I think where we left off we were on a building, but uh, that doesn't matter. That's fine. Uh, where we left off, we just done the first episode, obviously, and we just got to Constantinople, and we're looking for all the Masyaf keys. Well, I mean, right now we're just kind of helping the assassins in Constantinople, but you know we've been. We've been look, you know, we know that we have to get the Masyaf keys. We we know that's what we have to do. Let's do this viewpoint because I can. Even though we already know the surrounding area, I don't know what's going on there. But we're gonna do this viewpoint, and it's gonna be beautiful. There you go. Press the wrong fucking button for that. But yeah, Revelations looks beautiful. It looks. Look at it. It's it's so saturated. I love the look of Revelations. Like, everyone's like, oh, it's so fucking washed out, it looks like shit. When in reality... Fuck, I like no money. It's not washed out at all, it's beautiful. I love Revelations. It's it's so underrated. It's so underrated. People, like, kind of look over Revelations. Oh, I've got, I've got no fucking money, I can't do any renovations, this is heartbreaking. But yeah, Revelations is super, super underrated. I haven't actually played it properly and got a look at the game yet. I've only kind of played it on a 24-hour stream. But looking at it, it, everything is so sharp. I love our fucking Revelations looks. I've always loved that Revelations looks. But I, yeah, I always forget about it. It's always a game that for some reason seems forgettable and I have no idea why. Let's loot this cunt. I only had 35. Oh wait, no, yeah, the bullets and the well, the stuff that you get out of looting people comes late, doesn't it? It's fucking weird. It's like it all comes instead of all coming up at once, it comes up at different times. So you have to wait. So I thought I only got money, whereas in reality I got a fucking old ton of shit. Actually, the NPCs in this game, like when you loot them, they give you so much shit. It's amazing. Oh, it's a little chest. This only gives me bomb stuff, doesn't it? Yeah, but only gets bomb stuff. Damn it, I don't even have a cup of tea either. That's not fair. I would have expected a nice cup of tea. Like, I always try to make a cup of tea before a video now. Like, I was going to record so much earlier, but I didn't. I have no fucking idea why. But, um, yeah, I'm sad. I don't have a cup of tea, man. That's depressing. Ezio, come meet my new friend. Oh, well, we're gonna meet Yusuf's new friends now. Sorry, I got a fucking text on my phone. I was a bit... Oh, God. Come on, then. There you go. Look at that. That was beautiful. You fight like a man late for his own wedding. See, si. by about 25 years. I was too late to save the bazaar then, unfortunately. But now that my army has doubled in size, we'll take it back together. This way! When the Templars take control of a district, they flaunt their presence. Hanging banners, extorting the merchants, it's a constant battle to... You want to move, right? Yusuf, mate. And they rub our noses in every victory. There you go. They are quite bold. Why does the Sultan tolerate this? Sultan Bayezid is far away, Ezio. Warring with his son Selim, many Fersa northwest of the city. He has been away for years, at least since the earthquake. And maybe even before. He is blind to all this turmoil. Ah, but your eyes are open, see? Hem de Tashigibi. Believe it. Classic Yusuf. I love Revelation's Ezio robes. They're so... They are, they're just so good looking. Too many to engage directly. Uh, I am not confident a smoke bomb will help us here. Smoke bomb? Ezio, it's time you Italians joined the 16th century. These do not obscure. They distract. There you go, Yusuf's. Yeah, they're all like, what the fuck? What happened there? They can't resist. And then we Let's walk on right through. You are full of surprises today. I love the feature in Revelations. Oh god, this guy is like so similar. I love the feature in Revelations where you just walk past. I mean, you walk with your person. I'm beginning to wonder. Yeah, I love the feature in Revelations where you just, like, you know, walk with the, like, companion guy. Like, because now we're just walking with Yusuf at his pace. It's great. Whereas in the other ones, sometimes they walk quicker than you, they walk slower than you, and it was fucking annoying. 
So it's great in Revelations, you can just kind of just sit back and let Ezio walk for you. It's such a good feature. And then it was taken out in AC3, because to be quite fair, in AC3 there's not an awful lot of just walking with people. Whereas there is in the Ezio games. Which is never something that I minded, really. Your turn. Make me proud. There you go, let's throw that shit. Cherry bomb. I hate the bombs. I find them completely pointless. Let's wait for everyone to get out of the area. There's no, no point in harming innocents with that bomb. There you go. Oh, we can't get our blades back. That's annoying. And they go over there, and then we walk through. Go. Let's get everything back. Oh, God. Hidden gun can be down. Until we get the, uh, until we get the crossbow, it can be down. Hurry, we're nearly there. Oh, we can't run with him. That's annoying. Uh. Wait, why did Yusuf not use the hook blade for that? He just climbed up it normally. Uh. What's he doing? Wait, was that? That was a proper chest. I want that. No, Yusuf, just wait there for me. Yeah, just wait there. No, Yusuf, wait. <laughs> He's like, why is Ezio just standing all the way back there? Wait for me! Wait for the... Wait for the mentor! This is another of our many dens, taken by Templars, as you can see. Somewhere among this rabble is a Templar captain. Kill him, then climb the tower and light their signal fire. This warns the Templars that it is time to pack up and go. Bene, you create a distraction. I will send them home. Yusuf understands Italian, apparently. He understands what bene means. Always found that weird in this game. It's very odd, like, because Yusuf always goes, he has trouble, you know, understanding the Italian gibberish. He understands bene. And is Ezio speaking in, like, Turkish or whatever the fucking language is the entire time? Is he talking in that? Because that's weird. Why would his accent be... Oh, I don't fucking know. You know, would his accent be... The same? Like, no one fucking knows. No one know what these are questions that literally cannot be answered because they cannot be fucking answered because it would break everyone. Everyone would just crumble into a massive pile on the when ground. The Templars commandeer one of our dens. They leave a captain in charge. Search the area carefully. And you oh. will see him strutting about like a peacock. There he is. He's a little peacock. Oh wait, I should have fucking carried on zooming in on him. Shit. No, I'm alright. Let, let me just... I'll just climb up here. It's all good. We should be able to use a throne. Okay, thank fuck we could use that on that guy. Because I would cry if not. I'd just straight up just cry. Can we assassinate him? Oh yeah, let's just double assassinate. Actually, how about we use throw a knife on you, and then we just assassinate those guys. Oh fuck! The den captain usually carries a lot of money as well. I don't think this is the den captain we're looting here. No, it's not. Oh god, maybe it was actually. Yeah, actually it was. Shit. Oh, there's a little chest over here. Might as well get that money so you can get those renovations in. Look, if there's anything I love, there's anything you should have learned about me in playing Assassin's Creed games. There's nothing I love more than renovating things. Oh, fuck. There you go. What a silly man. Also, the blood looks a lot better in Revelations, although it does still glitch around Ezio's body once you stab someone, which is kind of silly, but... Who cares? Revelations looks beautiful. Fuck anyone that says it doesn't look beautiful. I'm pro Revelations. You can fuck off if you're anti Revelations. Like, I love this game. Plus, it's got Ezio in it. Ezio's so sassy in this game because he's old. He just doesn't care. There you go, boy. The signal fire is lit. Lit AF. <laughs> the signal fire is lit. There you go. Alright then. We got a bit of money from that as well. Wait, is that the memory sequence done? Oh, I think it is. I think that's sequence two done, actually. Let's run. 
Do not create any conflict in the Imperial North District. I don't understand. Hey, you got memory sequence two complete. Awesome. Beautiful. Now do we get a bit more Desmond action? A bit more Desmond and Clay banter? I'm seeing very strange activity in the Animus. Oh? The CPU should be fairly idle, but the system monitor is spiking regularly, sometimes as high as 85%. Is it serious? I'm not sure. Desmond's signs are stable. Well, if there isn't a problem, let's not try to fix anything. Fair enough. God, I need a drink. Rebecca needs to get pissed, boy. She needs to get fucking drunk. Sixteen? Desmond, think about this. What if I went with you? With me? Where? It could work. Just for a while. Until I found a way out. Another body, maybe, or a... I don't know. I just... I don't want to be here anymore. That's... That's not going to happen. I'm sorry. No. <laughs> yeah, I guess I had my chance. <laughs> and I wasted it. Poor Clay, man. He's all by himself. Look how good the grass looks, actually. I really like the look of it. Closer than friends. Uh, well, there was the occasional misty eyed mm. moment, but. Having a little chat about Desmond and Lucy there. Bill? That's what she told me. Hmm. Interesting. That's she liked him. Just interesting? I spent a lot of time training each of them when they were younger. She was a remarkable woman. I just find this whole situation quite sad. Sad? Are you finally getting soft on us, Bill? Classic. Look at how Desmond runs in this. He runs like Ezio. Like, he doesn't run like Desmond. Like, he jogs like Desmond. And he doesn't walk like Desmond. He walks like Ezio. Look. It's weird. And he definitely runs like Ezio because Desmond does not run like that. It's so... Why do they, why do, they do that? This makes no sense. I didn't want to risk cutting that conversation off. Constantinopoli, called Istanbul by the Turks, has welcomed me as one of its own. The assassins here, led by an affable fighter named Yusuf, take great pride in their city. A place as diverse and colorful as one could imagine. But it is a troubled city too. A rebellious faction of Byzantine Templars still fights to retain influence. And their recent attacks have delayed my search for the Masyaf keys. But this will not last. As soon as I am able, I will begin looking for Niccolo Polo's former trading post. In search of clues that will bring me nearer to the Masyaf keys. There you go, yeah, I didn't want to risk cutting off that little dialogue between uh, Rebecca, Sean and William. Because, um... Because, yeah, that's part of the story, and you guys need to hear that. And I wanted to hear it, too. You know, it's been a while since I've actually played this game and listened to the story of it and played it properly. Because I have played it, but I've only played it, like, on the 24-hour stream, and it's it, it, it's just, you know. How did we do? We have won the day and recovered that den. But we lost a few friends in this fight. So much death for so little gain. You have some experience recruiting new assassins, do you not? More than a little. The people here are quite sick of these Templar attacks. Can you turn on your charms and find us a few more recruits? See, si. but these den will not do for training them. Not this soon. A good point. Speak with one of my men in Galata after you are finished. He can help you begin their training. There you go. Now we get to train recruits. There's a Templar lair over there. But I want to use this money that we have now to do some renovations. Now, I know I'm not going to go out of my way to find a place to renovate. I'm just going to, you know, renovate everything I come across. So we can get a steady income in Constantinople and everything will be good. 
Oh shit, I was about to loot that guy then. That would have been good. That would not have been good at all because I would have been seen by those fucking guards. Uh, oh, there's an animus fragment there. Let's grab that. Well, actually, no, I shouldn't. I shouldn't grab that, actually. Oh, fuck. The lengths I go to not to pick things up. I think there are shops here that we can renovate, but we need to do a tower first, so we can go do that if you want. Let's mark it on the map. There you go, mark it. There it is. We might as well do it, because we're going to have to do them at some point, and, you know, I, I, want, I want to do it. I enjoy doing these ones. They're even more fun than Borgia Towers. Like, you think guys thought I loved doing Borgia Towers? Because I fucking did loads of them in the Let's Play in Brotherhood. I fucking love Galata Towers. Galata Tower, not Galata Towers, not what they're fucking called. I love doing the Templar Dens. I'm a fucking... I'm a twat. Like, I hate Den Defense. Don't get me wrong. Oh, what the fuck am I doing? That's horrible. Den Defense can, like, fuck off. I hate that. But... I like killing the Templar captain and stuff. And plus it gives us a lot of money. Gotta sneak up on this boy. This guy's a bad boy. Okay, there should be a Templar captain somewhere. It's not either of those. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you, what are you doing, mate? What are you doing, mate? There you go. We got him. We got him. Let's loot him. There you go, we're sorted. We are actually, we are, we are sorted. Those guys are still looking for us though. Oh god. Let's just, let's just, you know. Okay, there you go. We're alright. We're alright. We're too high up now, they can't see it. There you go. We can light the signal fire now and we'll get a bit of money from that as well. I fucking love doing these towers, man. You don't understand. You guys do not understand. I love these towers. Oh, we didn't get a bit of money from... Oh, fuck. We didn't get a bit of money from doing it. I thought we would get money. Because you get money from the Borgia Towers in Brotherhood. Assassins now control this den. Seems like all the fast travel stations are done as well. They don't have to be rebuilt. Yeah, that's really weird. There's not many places to renovate it. Oh, maybe that's because I haven't done any viewpoints, so that, you know, it seems like there's no places to renovate. Okay, let's go do the blacksmiths. We can go renovate the blacksmiths. And then we can see if we can buy some more armor. Edsir's braces really fucking trigger me. Like, oh. His, his, like, his braces are, are brown, yet his shoulder plates are, are, are fucking silver. We need to fix that right now. Now that the assassins grunt all this den, buildings can be renovated. Here you go. That's... I mean, it's not a fab, bro, is it? Can't really... Can't really read it. Okay, armor. Azap leather braces. There we go. Crossbow costs 18. It costs even more in this game. It's fucking bullshit. Do to buy a dagger? Weapons, we can't buy any of the weapons. We can buy a dagger though. We can buy just like a shitty. We can buy a shitty Kurdish ja Jambia. Jambia. Oh, there you go. Now our, our armor's a bit more in keeping. Like it's a bit more color coded now. Well, not color coded, it's a bit, it just looks better, alright? It just looks better. And we can do the bank. There you go. Banks bring in a lot of money. Oh, Constantinople's income increased to 1,900... Fuck! Well, we already get so much money every 20 minutes. What's going on there? Do we have any income? We do not as of right now. That's that's disappointing. That doesn't matter. We're fine. Well, that's, that's a nice amount of income, like, in the second episode. I guess it's because there's less places to renovate. So when you renovate one place... Wait... I can hear like the whispers. Doesn't that happen when someone's about to stab you in the, in the back or something? Let's get on a rooftop. I don't like that. I know that man. You know the man. You do know this man, but I'm leaving. Goodbye. Huh. When do we get like assassin signals though? 
That's exciting. Hello there. Are you a compassionate man, Finley? Can you help me? That I stole fruit from a vendor, I will not deny. But only because my hunger has trumped my honesty. Bring me the key to these chains, and I will repay you tenfold. To be quite fair... Wait right here. Uh, obviously. I mean, not to be quite fair, I don't know what the fuck I meant by that. But, um, we get assassin recruits now. I just asked when we get assassin recruits, but we get them right fucking now. Find the guard holding the key. We've got so much fucking notoriety. Oh, there's, there's a herald there. Oh, we don't, I don't think we've even got enough to bribe him. Oh, yeah, we do. It's only a hundred, um, Akche in this game. Give me back my money! There you go. There's nothing wrong with stealing a bit, alright. I've also hit a million florins in Assassin's Creed 2. That's insane. A million florins. How insane is that? Is it, does this guy have the key? Let's see who's got the key. Do you have the key? Do you have the key, Messere? Oh, I love how this bit looks down there. Sorry, boys. Let me just get out of here. They're Byzantines, so they know me. They know who I am. Where the fuck is the guy, though? Is it... Is it this dude around here? Oh, fuck. Do these guys... Do they not want... Oh my god! Oh no, I didn't mean to do that! No! Ezio! I did not mean to fucking do that! Jesus Christ, well I might as well loot him now. Assassin. Well, at least they know who assassins are. Oh fucking hell. Okay. Where's this guy? Where's the damn guy with the bloody key? Let's find him once and for all. Uh, is he there? I don't. I have no clue. What's going on? Oh, he's dead now. We've started another bloody conflict. Bloody hell, what are we doing? Oh, they're all dead. Uh, let's just kill everyone, basically. That's that's my that's my course of action here. Let's kill everybody uh, because there's there's no better way of doing things. Why can't I find this guy who's got the key? What's going on? What am I doing wrong? Oh, there he fucking well is. Was 100% sitting because it looted off of him. Pickpocket the guard. There you go. Oh, fuck. I did pickpocket the guard. It's not my fault. Leave me be. Uh, we need to bribe this herald as well. That's probably sh something that we should do. So. Oh, God. Well, who did I just run into? What the fuck? What's up here? Is there a bale of hay up here that I can use? There is. There is indeed. In Brotherhood, it. Oh, there you go. In 2, it takes so long for them to stop seeing you. Oh, God. They're having a fight now. They're having a battle. Alright, let's just go release this guy. You humble me, Fendim. I will return to the merchant I robbed and show him the same kindness. After you have cleared your conscience, amico, consider joining our cause. To be an honest man, one needs honest work. I would be honored. Saul. And you go with our first recruit there, and the rest of them are still scumbags sitting in there. They don't want to be let free. Look how good the water looks in Revelations. Like, it, oh, it's so good. It looks too good. Alright then. Okay, now we can recruit assassins by saving them. Okay. 
interesting. Let's go and bribe this Herald, then we'll steal our money back. Because we can. I'm just, just going to bribe you a bit there, mate. But, uh, uh lol, I'm just going to take my money back because I'm a cunt. <laughs> I fucking love that you can do that. It's the best thing ever. Okay, the boats and revelations are fast as fuck as well. Wait, look at this. Maybe that's just me thinking they're faster than they actually are. Yeah, look at that shit. It just fucking zoomed out, and I can't... I can't actually turn it left. Right, I mean. Oh, I can now. That's the things with the with the fucking gondolas in, like, the Ezio games. Sometimes you can't turn them a certain way. It's really odd. Press A to quit driving. <laughs> to quit it. Oh, I could have... I could have taken the, the ferry across, couldn't I, actually? Silly me. Oh, I guess I've already done... What's done is done. We can't... There's no point in going back and getting the ferry across. We've already made our own way. And this mission is far away. At least it's not as big as Rome. Because Rome is... Rome is massive. And it, and, it, and it takes up a lot of time getting from point A to point B. You know what? I think once we get to the objective, it'll be a perfect time to to end the mission. I mean, end the episode, not end the mission. Because, uh, you know, we're, we're right close to 30 minutes, and I'd rather not have it run over too much. So, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Be sure to go ahead and smack, smack the like. Go ahead, be sure to go ahead and like and subscribe for more if you have to create content in the future. And also, comment down in the comment section below what you thought of this video. And I'll see you guys in the next episode of Assassin's Creed Revelations. Bye!